What's up, you guys? I want to introduce you to my Infantino. It's a flip four in one convertible baby carrier, and it is really, really great. And I want to just show you all the different positions that you can hold your baby. Now, the first thing you'll notice is it's actually really strappy. I mean, literally, it's got a lot of straps and um, at first that can be a little daunting because you're going to wonder where all the straps go. But to be honest, I wouldn't have it any other way because every strap is an adjustment. Every strap means that you can adjust how tight or how loose that you want it. I love that adjustability. So that means it's comfortable for me. It's comfortable for my husband and it's comfortable as my babies get bigger. Let me show you what it looks like. Once you have the carrier on, there are a few buckles that you will need to snap together and then secure and tighten. This does take a little bit of getting used to to figure out which buckle goes where, both on your upper back and your low back. I really like the low back support. It helps put more of the weight onto my hips rather than just my neck. So once you have the straps on, you just grab your baby and then buckle them on the sides and then buckle them both a little bit higher as well. I think it's really important to point out that a baby carrier should have the legs to go in a V towards you and not to be straight down. That's not a good position for the baby. You want their legs to be bent up towards you. Also, if your baby's a little bit bigger, then you have those extra little buttons that you can use to snap uh, to keep your baby's legs again in that V shape. It's also more comfortable for them. And then like I mentioned before, you can adjust the straps as much as you want. I'm gonna tighten it up here and here at the bottom as well. And then my baby's comfortable and it is so comfortable for me. If your baby's a little bit smaller and you need some head support, you have that option too. Now, when your baby is a little bit older and is ready to see more of the world, you can also have them forward facing. You basically put them in the exact same way, but you just turn them forward. There are armholes for your little baby when they're smaller. Of course, when they're a little bit bigger, they can have their arms above those straps. And there are extra buttons, again, to help support your baby's legs so that they stay in a good, comfortable position as well. Now, when your baby gets even older, there is a third option that you can do. You can wear the baby on your back, kind of like a little backpack. You're gonna need to have someone help you load your toddler onto your back. And then they can help adjust the straps to secure your baby and to make sure that they are comfortable from the back end. And then for you, you then have the front straps where you can adjust where you want things tighter and where you want them looser so that you are comfortable and that your back and your shoulders feel supported. I definitely would not put a young infant on my back, only an older toddler. Um, this would be great for backpacking or for hiking or just going on walks. When those little legs get tired, you can just pull them up onto your back and they can continue to enjoy spending time with you and feeling comfortable and secure. 